Today is Saturday, but then there's an event that we're, the Nigerian club is hosting, right? So the you no know, Nigeria had like Nigeria had their independence on the first of October, which was on Sunday, but then that was a weekend, so we couldn't host it. That was on Sunday. So we're hosting like an event today for the Nigerian students in at TRU, right? So it's just to like come and have fun and stuff like that. And it's the Nigerian club that is hosting it. I just joined the club. And I'm also going to be the host for the event. So let's go and host this event. I don't even know why I volunteered to host. It's not like I'm a host. But yeah, or a hostess. But let's let's try our best. <laughs> no food, no hosting. People are trying, you know. Wow. Guys, this is how the hall looks like. It's basically like a conference hall. Right? So, yeah. I'm trying to fix this mic that is not working. And basically, this is how everything looks. It's probably where. Yeah. Let's make this event happen. And you guys look at the shirts. They have like green. They're yeah, nothing. <laughs> green. It's like green, white, green, right? It's cool. Is there anything that 
Six years. Well, see, look, listen. It's not my my story is not your story. Yeah. Do you understand? Don't use me as an SI unit. It took me over seven years to get my PR. That's my story. That's not going to be your story. It's going to be easier for you. Mine. You don't even want to walk the shoes. My shoes at all. My everything was was ghetto. <laughs> it was ghetto. Um, So moving on from that, uh, yeah, I don't think you guys can so well. Yeah, moving on from that, um, today is Tuesday, uh, 10th of October. You guys, <laughs> I know it has been long since I put out content, a little bit long, not so long ago, but... I wanted to tell you guys that I was actually supposed to put the content of like traveling to Vancouver with I traveled to Vancouver like last weekend last two weekends right so like the 29th 30th and 1st of October I was in Vancouver and I edited the video on CapCut and I mistakenly deleted it and honestly I don't have the strength to re-edit that video again plus I have midterms already this is like the week of midterms so I will not be able to, I don't think I'll be able to edit that video of Vancouver. Basically, um, I don't know, maybe if I can, I would, like, in the future, but no, nah, I don't, no. Nah. I don't have time for that, and even this one, I don't even know when I'm going to edit it. Yeah, so, I don't know, I just want to, like, quickly inform you guys and update you guys on everything, like, there is really nothing going on so much, and you know me, I don't really feel, like, my daily life because it's my daily life like it's just like there's nothing interesting it's just waking up going to school classes coming back doing assignments up until late in the night going to bed basically that's what i do right so i don't really do much as a person like my activities are not so much they just like revolve around like you know school and work and home and school and work and home that's me that's me for you and that's me for me so yeah i don't know you guys will probably have been like wondering why i haven't put out like why i haven't been putting constant um constant 
putting out constant con content putting out constant content on a <laughs> consistent schedule right um it's cause like my life is it's not it's it's not like it's not interesting to me it's just that's just how it is for now right um that's just basically my life for now i'm just someone who is trying to get by school and you know get into a nursing program <laughs> that's like the biggest thing in my head right now getting into nursing yeah and so all my energy is just being directed towards that and basically i'm just letting you guys know that you know there's really nothing much going on in my life um and i'm sure there are points that there are points like like that in our lives in the different places right where you know sometimes it's high sometimes you have like a lot of activities going on and the other times it's just like repeating activities right so that's basically the point right that's basically the point where i am right now and i'm not really concerned about it because <laughs> that's life we're just living life right yeah um so basically i just thought to update you guys i don't know there's there's really nothing to update 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 you guys like i told you i went to work over if i eventually will edit the video then you guys are going to see it i'll just post it right it doesn't have to come one after the other right so i will just post it if i eventually get the strength and the time right i have the strength it's actually the time that i don't have for that video to do that video my hands are dry and i do not like that my hands are dry so um yes i'm just letting you guys know right so yeah don't expect like consistent like overly consistent <laughs> content from me like back-to-back -back content i'm not someone who would feel is i do lifestyle right but like it's not like that that kind of lifestyle where, like, where i'm filming every single day of my life if i'm filming every single day of my life then i'm not living at least to me that's it it means that to me that means i'm not living right yeah and i don't want to be that person that gets to too conscious of filming right there's some certain things that like literally i would just want to film but yeah i don't want it to be something that becomes an impulse that every single time i you know i see something i would want to film i don't want to become that person i want to film what i want to film and <laughs> live live where i want to live right live at the time that i want to live right yeah i don't know filming is not bad though but like Honestly, to be honest, you can you can get into that cycle and you can get into that pit hole where like you 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 will not want to be filming the aspect of your life, which I do not want to do, and I which I do not, and that's not the person I want to become. So we're not going to do we're not going to take actions towards that, towards becoming that person because that's not the person I want to become. Um, basically that's all. And you guys, yeah, these days I'm thinking of drinking. I don't know if you guys can see this light. Stop reflecting. Green tea. So this is jasmine green tea. Yeah. So. Yeah, it's also part of the things I want to incorporate into my schedule. Starting to drink teas. Like my dad. <laughs> yeah, and then there is this other one. This, this one is a Japanese fuki powdered green tea. I don't know how that's going to taste. It's very terrible, but yeah, it's healthier apparently, right? My dad has always been someone who loves tea. Like there is no day that I've known my dad and I've not seen him drinking tea. Literally, from the time that I can remember that my dad was my dad, like when I started obviously noticing my dad's routines, he always takes tea. In the morning, he's taking tea. In the office, he's taking tea. In the night, he's taking tea. So. <laughs> And when I mean tea, I mean like green teas and, and, and stuff and different kinds of teas. So, yeah, it's it's obviously healthier. Me, I take juice. You you can catch me taking juice in the morning, in the midday, in the afternoon, in the mid-afternoon, in the night, even in the midnight. <laughs> you can catch me drinking tea, right? Sorry, drinking juice. But, um, yeah, I want to switch that up. At least drink juice once in a while, but, you know, take tea. I want it to become part of my routine because it's healthier. And some of these 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 
teas are relaxing like this jasmine one is like a relaxing tea and it also has like a really nice scent and if you know me you know i love aromas and scents so far as they are nice i like them so i, I feel like it's something i can you know inculcate into my routine now that that is done i need to go and read yeah plus i have a meeting to attend kind of like a business meeting to attend from 8 to 10. i don't know something is like brooding i don't know what it is right now the thing is that i haven't even wrapped my head around it i don't know what it is exactly and i've been i've just like in my mind i've just been talking to god about it i've actually not actively prayed about it right because i was like in my mind it's just like god i didn't ask for this so i don't know i don't know i should probably pray about it but i was just like should i pray about it because i did ask for it i was on my own and it came right it's looking like it's an opportunity a good opportunity but then it's an opportunity i didn't ask for which is weird that i which which when i was also thinking about it i was like why do you feel like like when i was like I was like, why do you feel like you you can't get opportunities? Like, you don't have to ask God for every single thing before he gives it to you. I mean, that's part of the perks of being his daughter, right? Is that you... He, I mean, just like a parent to child, like, you know, kind of relationship where your parents just, you know, oh, they, they were probably going out and then they just remembered, oh, to get you something, even if you didn't tell them to get you something, right? And they say, oh... Let me just get you maybe this thing right so it's kind of like th th that's exactly how this opportunity looks to me or this thing looks to me that is happening so i don't know i don't want anything that is going to take an extra effort out of me other than the effort i'm already even putting into my life right now because i don't feel like i'm expending too much energy so i don't want to i don't know the bottom line of it is that I don't know what this is. <laughs> you guys are probably confused, but even me, I'm trying to work around it. And one of the ways I work around things is talking, right? I don't know. Yeah. It's talking. And I figure that that helps. I don't know. My mentor was actually the one that noticed it. When I ask her questions, she always makes me talk. And I now, f somehow, somehow, I end up answering my own questions. So, yeah, that's what I was trying to tell you guys. This is actually the first time I'm voicing it out. Even to anybody to myself to any to 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 anybody so i'm just saying i don't know i i would pray about it that if it's a good thing it's a good thing right if it's something that god wants me to be in or have or eventual into i would yeah he should just he should just not make me put in an extra energy <laughs> and effort because yeah see i can be a lazy person now but i don't know jesus help me i don't know i don't know um yeah so that's that's the update of my life right now so i'm just saying that oh i said that because like i'm supposed to have a meeting for that thing you know by eight to ten and i'm supposed to be dressed formally because it's a business meeting i don't know and it's scary the opportunity is scaring me it's not opportunity. I don't know why I'm calling it an opportunity, but like the whole thing is scary because I don't even know what it is. Whether it's an opportunity or always like, I don't know what it is. It's weird, you guys. It's weird, but like I don't know what it is. Which is why I'm nervous because I don't know how to be or what to. I don't even know. <sighs> I'm just taking it as it comes. I mean, if if it ever if it eventually doesn't work out, I'm not going to be faced because like. I didn't ask for it, but like, if I get it, I will be really happy. Cause I don't know, that's like, it gives me like a, it's like, it helps with number one. Like I get to be in a community of people who value the same things that I value, and you know, and I'm also trying to help people who value, who have like similar values, right? So it's like, yeah, if 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 it's an opportunity that eventually works out, then I would appreciate it. But then I'm saying that even if I don't end up getting the opportunity, or even if I don't end up, you know, even if it doesn't end up working out, I'm going to be fine also. Yeah. That feels good to get out. Alright, so I'll see you guys for next week, you guys. I need to go and read for my test. I have a test on Friday. 
it has started with now anatomy and physiology so and started with the integumentary system that's a system i've never read or ever like seen the i've never like really put efforts to learning anything about this the integumentary system which is like this system of like you know skin basically the skin and you know tissues and blah blah, blah. <laughs> i'm sorry non-science people but yeah so i'm going to read that because i'm like i just said it is not friday i'll see you guys when i see you guys i'll see you guys when next i see you guys whatever that content is bye